Brain cells use electrical pulses as part of their computational um, machinery. If you could stimulate electrical pulses, then you could test causality. You could ask whether certain patterns of brain activity are important for a behavior or for a disease for that matter. Now, electrical stimulation is very powerful. It's been used to treat people with Parkinson's disease, for example, but electricity goes in all directions. And with optogenetics, we can aim light at individual cells or just one kind of cell. And you have to make the cells turn light into electricity, you know, the equivalent of little solar panels that you would install on the cells. And we adapt them from the natural world. So all over the tree of life, you can find proteins that convert light into electrical signals. We can put the gene into the brain cell using any one of a number of standard gene delivery methods. The neurons will then manufacture the light activated protein, shine light, and you can get light to electricity. Electricity stimulates the brain. So it's called optogenetics, opto for light, and genetics because these are genetically encoded molecules.